I'm not a, I respect Jeopardy, the game show, a great deal. But because of sports, I don't watch a ton of Jeopardy because that's my sports time. Tell me more about this sports. Sports. What but, is this sports you speak of? But like a <laughs> lot of people, they make time for Jeopardy in their life. Apparently, there's a Canadian lawyer named Aaron Craig who's getting blasted online for being rude after he won. I haven't seen this clip. Have you seen this? No, I haven't seen the clip, but I've heard of it, what it might be, and I'm very curious to see if it is, in fact, rude, his okay. behavior. What does rude mean in the Jeopardy world? Mm -hmm. Take a look. So it doesn't much matter what he wrote here, but what was it? No, didn't I didn't have, have it either. No, this was the reinterment of Richard III, whose body had recently been rediscovered in Leicester. So your wager might not matter much. 32, that's your kid's age, I assume, the sum of it, 9,768. And it puts you into the finals, Aaron. Congratulations. Let's go, Chad. Let's go. What? Sorry. What is rude about is there, that? Is there more video we're going to run on some, that? Is there another clip? That's the rude part of, of Aaron Craig's demeanor? Who is saying he's rude? That's ridiculous. That's ridiculous. Come on. I've seen like grand champions who you just wanted to fight that were just they were just rude all the time. Aaron's not rude. No. He's just celebrating. Yeah, he was having a little clap. I don't know. <laughs> Canadians are known around the world for being a little humble, a little nice. You know, we can cheer for ourselves. Thank you very much. But some of the comments online, this is what we're talking about. Someone wrote, is there a more unlikable contestant than Aaron? His reaction was just jerky as heck. What? Shut up. Jerky? Jerky as heck. And not uh, appealing. I actually found him quite appealing. <laughs> like, I, th I think he's quite likable. Who likes Aaron for 200? Yeah. Please. On Jeopardy. It's a do you, Aaron. Good for you, man.